Okay, so so for these ones, we really can't do this without calculus, so we're just going to kind of, you know, fudge this a little bit, right? So the change in S is going to be the heat that flows divided by the temperature, right? And the temperature, of course, has to be kelvins, right? So what we're going to do is we're going to say, well, from 24 to 22, we're going to say this is 23 degrees Celsius on the average. Okay. Uh, the heat that flows, heat is going to be mc delta t, right? So, uh, right, so it's going to be 0. 0.145 times 450. And then uh, it's going to be, and then our change in temperature is going to be 2 degrees, right? 24 minus 22. Oh, wait, you know what? This is going to be the other way around. It's going to be 22 minus 24, right? Because it cools down. There's going to be a change. Of cool, it's a cooling. Okay, so here we go. So we go 0.145 times 450 times negative 2. So our Q is negative 130.5, and then our change in entropy is going to be negative 130.5 joules divided by 23 plus 273.15, and that's going to be kelvins. So that guy divided by parentheses, 23 plus... I'm getting that that is negative 0 0.44065, and this is the units here are joules per kelvin, okay? I guess you'd say 441 with three sig figs. All right.